Thousands of years ago, in a distant land of great wonders and rich history, a true legend was born. Between the enchanting sapphire waters of the Aegean Sea and the mighty river Danube to the north, lived a great tribe of immense power and inexplicable strength. They called them Thracians. The people of this land were strong and healthy. Their bodies were carved by the wind and sun and stories were told that no illness could strike them. And everyone would envy the Thracians because they lived longer and were happier. Kerza was a curious gold-haired Thracian girl of deep blue eyes and bright mind. She would enjoy her parents' beloved tales of battles and victories, of kings and gods and malevolent creatures. However, one secret always eluded her curious mind and neither her father nor her grandfather knew the answer. What was that mysterious, silent force that guided and protected the Thracian people? Where did they draw their strength from? Her pearl-white teeth, her shining hair and velvet skin made her beauty inexplicable in those ancient times. At night, by the fire, under the stars, she would ask a thousand questions, embraced by the strong arms of her father, Scaris, a fearless warrior who loved her more than life. Kerza's eyes were sad sometimes. She wondered if happiness was meant for all. Then how come others were getting sick and the Thracians never did? Scaris did not know the answer. He too heard only legends from his father who shared the wisdom of their ancestors. Late at night, when the Thracians put the milk in the pot and went to sleep, the gods would send a gift, a tiny sparkle of life to do their magic. Then the milk was transformed into yogurt or the food of life, as the Thracians knew and no one got sick. Kerza's little stomach never hurt and she would live to see many winters like her grandfather. This was their way of life for they were Thracians, blessed by the gods. Kerza was no longer a little girl, her beauty was breathtaking. Scaris never left her from his side and he protected his daughter like a precious gem. The gods kept doing their magic and the yogurt kept the Thracian tribe safe from harm. Like her father and her grandfather before him, Kerza was never sick. And then she met him, her love. He came from the north with another great tribe. They came on horses in vast numbers. They were the Bulgars. The Thracians and Bulgars shared their wisdom and a new society was born. Stronger, happier, healthier. A society that today still prepares the food of the gods. The ancient Bulgarian yogurt that has been made for thousands of years on these lands. For traditions are meant to be shared and preserved for the benefits of all humans everywhere on earth.